What's up everybody, it's Tyler on. Welcome to the video, welcome to the vlog. Skinny boys, gang. <laughs> um, uh, it's just a little little sample I picked up. Thought I'd, you know, see how it fit. Skinny boys, baby. Anyways, guys, I just started a new job, so my schedule's been a little bit off. This is my first off day. I just got done doing a leg session outside, and it is 12.20. Um, I usually don't eat anything in the morning or anything like that. I like to work out fasted. Um, if I'm working out during the evening, I'll, you know, I'll eat breakfast and then probably not do lunch fast and then have a big dinner. But today's a little bit different because I'm getting on this new work schedule. So I just got leg day, like I said, and it's 12.20. We're gonna be eating at 12.30 today. Let me show you what I make, you guys. First thing I'm gonna be putting in my body food-wise is gonna be a smoothie. We're gonna be putting in two bananas, two tablespoons of peanut butter, and then a little bit of spirulina. Guys, this is super powerful. If you put a whole tablespoon, even a whole teaspoon in something that doesn't have a lot of sweet stuff in it, it's gonna just overpower it. So be careful with this, okay? I just, I use this as a source of iodine, all right? Maca powder, I just started using this. Shout out to Scott Bernhard. It tastes literally like caramel, but this is for energy. It, Im it improves sex drive. Um, it's got a lot of good, good things with it. And I'm still researching it, but this, this is good shit. I can already tell um, just by how it makes me feel. Some coconut water for texture or coconut milk. And then we got some hemp seeds. These are amazing for protein, fiber. They also have good omega, what is it? Omega threes, I think. It's, it's the fats that you don't typically get. Um, these are really good for that. And then what else we got? We got chia seeds. You gotta soak your chia seeds, guys. You can't just put chia seeds and flax seeds and stuff just raw and not soaked. It doesn't work like that. You gotta break down their shell first. And this is what they use as like an egg substitute because it gets all thick and they spread out and stuff. So we're gonna put all these in the blender, y'all, and get right. And then, of course, I'm gonna be using water as well in there too. It's not gonna be just all coconut milk. All right, let's get it. Ooh, what's up, blender? What's up, baby? I know it's been a while. I got you. I got you right now. I got you. Don't trip. So, a lot of people are probably like, I don't know, the people who have been genuine to my channel and who have been following me for a while, you guys know that in the mornings, I'm just strictly, I'm religious with what I put in my body. And usually not even usually like literally 99 times out of 100 it's fruit it's only pure fruit and watery fruit i don't even mess with bananas in the morning it'll be something like like a pineapple whole pineapple or a whole mango something like that sorry not a whole mango like four or five whole mangoes or uh, just something, something water baits, grapes, you know, stuff like that. And lately I've been doing calisthenics though, and it takes a lot more out of me. And especially with this job, I'm a grocery manager at Sprouts. So I'm <laughs> doing heavy lifting every single day at that job. And then I'm doing calisthenics on top of that. So, you know, just <laughs> running five miles and then fasting and then eating at 2 p.m. and then eating only fruit at 2 p.m. no protein or nothing and then eating at what 8 or 9 p.m. after I do a calisthenics workout it just you know it's not conducive to my health anymore like it just doesn't work that way I got to get more calories in because um, I can feel it I was getting up to 160 I weighed 160 for like one day <laughs> One whole day, and then, uh, gosh, maca smells so good. One whole day, and then um, started this job, and I went right back to 152, 153, you guys. Like, crazy. Why, yo? Like, I, so I got to be careful. Like, my weight really drops quick. Me and uh, my buddy, Javante, he lives back in Colorado. Me and him just... 
our weight, we can literally eat whatever we want and we just, you just shit it out. Like we just shit it out the next day or the next two days. Like we don't retain weight at all. So that's a good thing too, but um, yeah, I gotta be careful. So that's why I'm incorporating these denser foods. What is this? 1.5 tablespoon, we'll go, we'll go two tablespoons with the hemp seeds. You can never go wrong with hemp seeds, guys. These are amazing, amazing superfood. All right, we got that. I was gonna do berries as well, but man, my freezer is like on steroids right now and the berries are extremely frozen, so I can't even get them. Some peanut butter. I'm only gonna do one tablespoon peanut butter, not two. And I might have to put another banana in this thing. We'll see. And guys, another thing that would be crucial to this smoothie would be a supplement of, a lot of people would say protein, but I would say sea moss. Like if you have sea moss, um, wild crafted Irish sea moss, not foreign grown, definitely put you some of that in here and if you don't know what that is look up videos of sea moss on youtube i'm not going to get into it but if i had sea moss right now i'd be putting that into everything but i left it back in colorado and i have too much pride to ask my mom to attempt too much pride to ask my mom to send me it so whatever but uh yeah sea moss is great it's got 90 percent of what your body's made up of in terms of uh minerals so it's a superfood for sure and a lot of people don't know about it people controlling shit pulling strings don't want you to know about sea moss i'm gonna put some water in this Fantastic. Now, I don't have a lid for my smoothie guys, so I gotta use a plate. All right, let's get it, let's mix it up.
All right, so guys, there you have it. Lovely smoothie. Let's do a little taste test. Mmm. Mmm. It's amazing. It tastes just like a banana peanut butter shake, honestly. I don't really taste the hemp seed spirulina. Again, be mindful with the spirulina. It will kill whatever you're making if you put a lot in there. Um, so yeah, that's how, that's how it is. That's delicious. Mm. This will get you guys going. Even if you're not doing calisthenics or nothing, my body's super efficient, I found. So if you're not being super duper active, you know, busting your ass every day, this will still get you right through the morning and the afternoon. I gotta say my prayers. I didn't even say my prayers before I drank this.